CPHI means exam preparation question and answer question number 301 a primary care physician typically provides routine care including health maintenance and management of new chronic disease which a specialty was specifically mentioned as a delivering primary care by default a emergency medicine b family medicine c internal medicine d pediatrics Answer A. Emergency Medicine Physician often provide primary care because the patient has no primary care physician. Most emergency medicine physician try to provide the necessary primary care and try to provide a referral to a primary physician. Question number 302. A nurse practitioner typically require what degree? B. Associate degree. B. Bachelor's of Science. C. Master's degree. D doctoral degree answer C nurse practitioners are usually required to earn a master's in disease nursing with a specific clinical and diagnostic training question number 303 the five rights of medication administration are a right department right nurse right patient right drug right time b right patient right drug right time right dose right route c right nurse right charge right drug right time right dose and d right nurse right patient right time right dose right route Answer B. The five rights listed in choice B have been taught to nurses for decades. Other rights that some professional now mentions are right region, right time, right documentation, right assessment, and right to refuse medication, but never right department, right nurse, or right charge. Question number 304. The Joint Commission, formerly known as JCAHO, accredits A. Entire healthcare organization, B. Outpatient healthcare providers, C. Just nurse, just nurses, D. Just physician. Answer A. Entire healthcare organization. Question number 305. What organization developed the National Patient Safety Goals, the Sentinel Event Policy, and the Speak Up Initiative? A. The Agency for Healthcare Research and Quality. B. The Health Resources and Service Administration. C. The Joint Commission. D. The Office of the Inspector General. Answer C. The Joint Commission. Question number 306. Which of the following is one of the main roles of the FDA? A. Regulate drug safety. B. Prevent wrong side surgery. C. Encourage patients to participate active in their healthcare. D. Develop performance measure for hospitals. Answer A. Regulate drug safety. Question number 307. Administrative hearings would be held for A. Social security appeals. B. Civil litigation. C. Criminal cases. D. Malpractice claims. Answer A. Social security appeals. Question number 308. The Affordable Care Act is selected to A. Provide better access to insurance. B. Improve health, improve public health. C. Increase Medicaid and Medicare payments. D. All of the above.
Answer D. All of the above. Question number 309. Which of the following is not true of hyper HIPA? A. New implant plan may limit coverage due to pre existing conditions. B. Improves access to long term care. C. If health insurance is lost, improves access to group health plan. D. Protect use of health savings accounts. Answer A. New employer plan may limit coverage due to pre existing conditions. Question number 310. The hyper security rule. A. Ensure compliance by the workforce. B. Requires coverage. In B. Requires covered entities. B. Requires covered entities to use security measures to protect health information. C. Anticipates threats to security and integrity of information and protects against them. D. All of the above. Answer D. All of the above.